Only on 6 now, we met with a Portland woman who was just set free from prison. Lisa Roberts spent the last 12 years behind bars for a crime she says she didn't do. In 2004, Roberts was sentenced for manslaughter and the death of her partner, Jerry Williams. But in April, a federal judge said the state needed to retry Roberts or release her from prison. Amy Frazier met with Roberts and her attorney this afternoon, and she joins us now. Amy? Tell me that the worst day of her life was the day she found out her partner was dead. She says the second worst day was the day she pleaded guilty to a crime she says she did not commit. If you didn't do it, why did you plead guilty? Uh, I was pressured. 48-year-old Lisa Roberts tells me she is grateful for her freedom and exhausted by the fight from prison to show her innocence. I wanted to know what it was like walking out of prison and greeting her lawyers one week ago today. Me being free, walking out those gates, that was like running into my family. So it was pretty amazing. This is video of Kelly Point Park in 2002, where police recovered the body of Jerry Williams, found naked and strangled. Devastating. It's somebody that I loved and care about, losing them like that, it's, it's devastating. After years of battling the conviction, in April, a federal judge concluded in this opinion and order that Roberts received ineffective assistance of counsel. I found out for that constitutional claim to even be considered, she had to show new evidence of her actual innocence. New DNA testing showed the DNA of two men on the victim's body, including a man who is currently in prison and has a history of violence against women. In this response letter I obtained from Multnomah County District Attorney Rod Underhill to the federal judge, Underhill states in reviewing the case, the Oregon Department of Justice, Portland Police and the DA's office have reached, quote, the same conclusion that Lisa Marie Roberts is responsible for the death of Jerry Williams. At the same time, though, it says we are not electing to retry Lisa Roberts, a decision Underhill states he made in part after talking to the victim's family and considering the fact that Roberts had served nearly all of the 15-year sentence. Did you kill Jerry Williams? No, I did not. So there are a ton of things that Lisa Roberts is getting used to right now. She says one thing is a Starbucks on every oh, corner. Yeah. Uh, she didn't know what an iPhone was. So wow, think about that. Yeah. Yeah, all the she, things that have changed over the years for her. Sure. She says it's a little bit scary right mm. now, but she's staying positive and she says she's just trying to take things one step at a time. Wow, amazing interview, Amy. Thank you. Thanks, Amy. Well we have some